Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. Today, we're going to learn about multiplying radical expressions. So if I was given this expression, square root of 15n squared times the square root of 10n to the third. All right, well, we can combine this under one big square root, so that's what I'm actually going to do. I have the square root here of 15 times, and I'm going to put 10 here, 15 and 10 next to each other, then times the n squared times the n to the third. So now we want to break each part down. All right. So 15 is 3 times 5. 10 is 5 times 2. n squared is n times n. And n to the third is n, n, n. Right? So now we have all this break broken down here. Okay. Let's go find our pairs. So we have a pair of 5s right there. We have a pair of n's right there. And another pair of n's right there. So each pair we can write on the outside of the single, so the 5s is a single 5 on the outside, the n, n's is a single n on the outside, and another n singled on the outside. On the inside we're left with 3 times 2, the singles, the 3, the 2's, and then that 1 n, that's right there. So now all that's left to do is to simplify. n times n, n squared, so we have 5 times n squared, times the square root of 3 times 2 is 6, 6 n. And there we go. Our final answer is just 5 n squared times the square root of 6 n. So let's recap. We have the square root of 15n squared plus the square root of 10n to the third. Well, we can combine this under one big square root, so the square root of 15 times 10 times n squared times n to the third, and we broke them down. 15 was 3 times 5, 10 was 5 times 2, n squared was n times n, and n to the third is 3n's being multiplied together. We circle our pairs, a pair of 5's, a pair of n's, and another pair of n's. The pairs represented a single on the outside, 5, n, and n, and all the singles are left on the inside square root, square root of 3 times 2 times n. We simplified that to get our final answer here again of 5n squared times the square root of 6n.